gotta check it out man for real this build will melt legendary dudes like nothing it'll melt heroic challenging any difficulty you want to play on you want to get your level up quick use this build fast man you will straight destroy the enemies it is the empress international mortar build with unbreakable on your chest piece so when your armor gets depleted you automatically regenerate your armor 95 percent Dude, it's super sick. Check it out, you guys. But before we get into showing you guys how I put together this build, do me a favor, slide on over, click the little red subscribe button, and help me support my channel. I'll need to get to 100 subscribers this month. So can you guys please help me do that? Just click the subscribe button real quick, and I keep putting out awesome videos with the ultimate builds. Thank you, guys. Now, let's get into this build. So go to the demolition specialization and you will get an extra 10% in increased explosive damage and you will also get the mortar artillery launch ordinance mod to increase deterrence ammunition count and mod to increase deterrence uh, damage so for this particular build using the demolition specialization is the way to go so this builds talents include capacitance with the capacitor exotic weapon Future Perfect with a Mechanical Animal Assault Rifle. Combined Arms for the 25% extra skill damage for 3 seconds. Unbreakable, which repairs 95% of your armor. Cooldown is 60 seconds. And then Alternating Current, which is on the Exotic Waveform Holster, where you get 30% skill damage, generating bouncing back and forth from each uh, skill you have. And then for my gear, we have the Hana U Corporation Mask with the Empress International Backpack. Weaver and Wear Chess Piece, China Light Industries Corporation Gloves, and then No Brand Set Holster because that's the Exotic Waveform Holster, and Empress International Knee Pads. Our overall skill haste for the whole build is 125%. 0.8% skill haste which leads to a 8 second mortar skill haste and a 21 second seeker mine skill haste which is awesome considering the damage the damage is completely off the hook with this build we have 2.9 million seeker mine skill damage And for our turret, our mortar turret, we have 33 point, or wait, 3.3 .3 mil damage. So this is definitely an awesome build. You guys want to try it and let me know how it works for you guys. And the cool thing about the mortar is it also causes bleed damage. And with this particular build, we have 57,000 bleed damage and the bleed duration lasts for 7 seconds. So... You know, you could also use the mortar build with a status effect build, which you guys might want to check out in my next video. I'm going to do a video of the Eclipse Protocol with the Riot Foam and Mortar Launcher. Oh, that build is going to be vicious. So, guys, go ahead and check out my channel, Tactical Chaos 1. 
and check out my playlist, Division 2's Best Builds. And if you guys haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do that right now. Slide on over and click that subscribe button and keep getting awesome creations on different ways to put together the ultimate skill builds, weapon damage builds, and armor regen builds.